happy with the place? Say hi. Good girl. Hey everyone, it's just Sarah here going hiking with my service dog Bailey right there. Um, we are just taking advantage of beautiful Colorado nature and getting a hike in. It's kind of chilly, but it's worth it. Um, I did want to tell a story. Um, so earlier we were hiking and in this area, depending on what the terrain's like um, and you know how safe it is and how many people are around, sometimes we will hike off leash. But whenever I see another dog, um, or I hear another dog or anything, or I see another group of people coming, I do put her on leash because you never know if someone's, you know, afraid of dogs or if their dog will be reactive or what the situation will be. And you always want 100% control over your dog. So, um, heard this family calling out for a dog's name. And so I put her on leash and I kept hiking on the trail. And next thing I know, this maybe seventh month old um, German Shepherd comes up, hackles fully raised, right up into Bailey's face. And she's right next to me in a heel, trying to ignore this dog, looking at me. And then this little girl screams from wherever she could see the dog. I couldn't see her, but she screams, oh my gosh, there's another person with a dog. And then what I'm assuming to be the mom of the family, or maybe older sister, um, comes and tries to chase their dog. The dog is continuing to circle Bailey with its hackles raised. Um, and so I'm just standing there, you know, trying to keep walking, keep Bailey moving. I had her sit at one point to see if, you know, stopping moving would stop the other dog, but it kept circling us and sniffing her and keeping its hackles raised. So finally, like, an older man came out of nowhere and like called the dog and got it over, but it's kind of dangerous. I was really worried. I didn't want to grab the other dog or anything, even while I was getting in Bailey's face, because you never know how another dog is going to react to someone. Um, you never know if it's going to be aggressive, it's, if it's going to get scared and snap or something. So um, you don't have 100% control over your dog. Don't take them off leash. <laughs> um, if you do have 100% control or at least reliable voice or e-collar control, then, you know, make the decisions that are best for you. I'm not going to say we always have Bailey on leash. You know, she gets some time to sniff around and hike off leash too, but I'm always considerate of the people around me and um, the safety of both Bailey and other animals. And this family was not ready. <laughs> for another dog to be hiking around their dog, and that dog was not ready. So, um, just a cautionary tale. Um, oh. oh goodness, she's like running around. Hey guys, I realized I didn't do an outro for this video, um, so thank you so much for watching. Um, please let me know if you want any more vlog style videos. Um, I really, you know, wasn't sure what I was doing, um, but I've heard with practice you get better at it. So let me know in the comments down below if you want any more of those, and please subscribe for more videos in the future. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Thanks! Bye!